to ask Auntie Loosh Time Puppets. Mm. I think today we've waited for long enough for your questions. It's time for us to get started. Now, last episode, you might remember, what was the Blonde Bimbo 69 mm. asked us a very special question? I saw Blonde Bimbo 69 today, and boy, was she blonde. <laughs> Bimbos. But today, we're going to help a few more people. So, Lachlan, darling, will you tell us what's the first question for all County okay. Lucia? So, Aunty Lush, we've actually got a few repeat customers that want more advice. They just didn't seem to get enough. So they've, they've, well, uh, I'm not surprised. There's mm. plenty of Auntie Luce to go around. That's right. That's right. A bit of a spit, <laughs> a bit of a spit roast scenario here, I believe. <laughs> so Auntie, <laughs> so Auntie Luce, blonde, yes, bim precious, blonde bimbo, sixty nine. Oh, blonde bimbo, sixty nine. <laughs> She's actually come back, and she wants to know. Come back, okay? Mm, yes, then. yes. <laughs> Does cannabis count as a herb? Well, of course it doesn't. Cannabis is not a herb, is no. it? I, I'm asking you. This, I don't. I've, I've, I've never tried the thing. This is your world. We're I'm just much more of a ketamine fan, <laughs> if you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, darlings. <laughs> Did you mean turning the kettle on? Is a that kettle, kettle yes, men. Yes, yes. Kettle men. I need a yes, kettle man downstairs right. to not, look after my not, kettle. Not, oh, not, not, Jerome, darling. <laughs> Not ketamine, Loosh, Auntie Loosh, it's kettle. Oh, I thought it was no. that, that's what you call the man who holds oh, the kettle. Oh, no, no. So you think, no, no. no. you've been watching too much late night TV, Auntie Loosh. No, oh, I heard it's really good on aeroplanes too. Oh, we fly <laughs> high on that stuff, my love, yes. Now, uh, Daddy69 lover. Ooh, I do love it, Daddy. <laughs> he wants to know, Loosh, Auntie Loosh, why do men have nipples? Men have nipples? You've never seen a naked man? No, Winston never <laughs> took his shirt off. Bless his soul. Oh, Poor we... old Winston always kept his shirt on when we were making coitus. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that yeah, men came yeah. with nipples. That is a really curious question. Yeah, well, um, what was it? Hung Daddy 69? Uh, daddy, daddy 69 daddy, lover. Yeah. Daddy 69. Oh, Daddy 69 yes. lover. I do like a daddy lover. Yes, yes, yes. Well, um... We've got, a, we've got another question here, Auntie Loosh, from Twig Boy. This is a replay. Oh, Twig yes, Boy, twig I saw boy. him today Yes, too. he was at the footy. Well, um, when he said that he was a twig, I didn't think he meant down there. No, no, <laughs> he did not. Now, Twig Boy is asking, if you enjoy wasting time, is that really time wasted? Of course it's not. Mm. Of course it's not wasting time. You couldn't mm. possibly waste time. You've only got one life. <laughs> I don't know how people talk about wasting time no, all the time no. when I just don't have the time for it. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. Auntie Loosh, we've got one here. Late night fatty. <laughs> now, Lachlan, darling, did you send this question in? <laughs> <laughs> Have you been snacking late at night again? Uh, I've heard you do like a visit to the fridge yes. and a, a drink of the milk bottle. At yes, yes. Weird yes. owls of the morning. Any chance I get to uh, get some la la into me, I'm all for it. Um, well, so I knew that about you, darling. So late night fatties asking uh, Auntie Loosh, what's your favourite midnight snack? <laughs> Funny we should mention mm, that mm. after after talking about your, right. your love of suckling the teat in the middle of the night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my late night my, my late night snack was dear old Winston. <laughs> okay. And boy, was he more than a snack, yeah. darling. Bit of a full, full blooded cranksky Ooh, it was kind like, of. It was like a buffet. <laughs> Precious Winston. Oh, uh, okay. So, Auntie Loosh. Is it true that cannibals don't eat clowns because they taste funny? That's from Advice Cow. No, I remember Herber as yeah, well. Yeah, she just couldn't take any advice. She, yeah, she didn't touch. She didn't listen to what you had to say last time. Was this time, the so one who last time was asking me about having a sugar daddy? I, think I believe it was. it was. I believe it was. And yeah. now she wants a cannibal? Well, she wants to know why don't cannibals eat clowns. Is it because they taste funny or... Well, I don't know. I've no. never eaten a clown before. No, no. So I have slept with one, though. No. Oh, Winston? Yes. No. <laughs> he was a clown for my dear old grandchildren's <laughs> birthday parties, darling. <laughs> Silly clown boy. Yeah, that was a bit of an odd question from Advice, advice Care, but we'll yeah, move on. as well. Um, she is a bit of a cow, we've got one. We've got Kiki on Fleeky. Uh, why <laughs> do we park... Kiki on Fleeky. Why do we park in the driveway, Auntie Loosh, but drive in the parkway? Bit of a... 
head twist of that one, yeah. What's a parkway? I guess where you drive only, Lush. Oh, I thought that was called a Back, road. Well, I when, guess I'm old-fashioned. Well, these, you... these Gen Zers and their new words and their fandangled things and mm. the little cellular Google machines and things. With GPS only, Lush. They're called GPS. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, so, I don't know the answer to that question. That's okay. Though. That's all right. Maybe Kiki on Fleeky can uh, just get on Google there. Yeah, maybe maybe, maybe Kiki on Fleeky needs to be Kiki on the school bus, the <laughs> short bus. Well, like, hang at the corner long enough, anything can happen. Um, that's exactly what I said to Advice yeah, Cow. No, I did too. <laughs> that's right. We are, we're going back in time. You're living in my head again, Arnie Luge. <laughs> all right. We've also got a question here from Fan with a Tan. <laughs> oh, I bet you she's been to Marianne's tan She room. certainly has. She got the $35 special because she mentioned the post credit show when she arrived. Now, Tan with a fan wants to know. Tan what? with a fan now? Yeah. Tan. This is two different people. Fan with a tan and tan with a fan. We're going with fan with a tan. With a tan fan? Correct. What does Auntie Louche love most about Lockie? Lachlan. Pass. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What does Loosh like about, love most about Lockie? <laughs> I don't write the questions. They just, I just read them out. I'm pretty sure that you did write this question, darling, Lachlan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I've got hold one. On, hold on, hold on, hold oh. on. I haven't given you my answer You yet. said pass, Auntie no, 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 no. Auntie Loosh said pass. Oh, same question for Loosh. Uncle Loosh said his giant <laughs> 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 Winston's not going to like that one. Winston's dead, <laughs> darling. <laughs> that was the next question. He's cold <laughs> meat in the freezer. Oh, is that with the baby? <laughs> Winston is the poor baby. <laughs> oh, Winston. But does um, that mean Annie Lou slept with a baby? Yeah, I'm not sure Ooh. where this has gone. But um, we've got another question here from Hungry But Empty. <laughs> <laughs> if I eat myself, would I become twice as big or just completely disappear? <laughs> 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 I bet that brings back memories from old Winston, doesn't it? Darling, I'm a swallow. Are you just <laughs> drinking all of this coffee? <laughs> so, yeah, okay, great answer, Only Loosh. <laughs> well done. Goodness me. Um, you we, people are perfect. Yeah, there's a lot of, uh, there's a fair bit going on here. Mm -hmm. um, we've got one from Naughty But Innocent. Liar. What would Auntie Louche do if you found a dead body in a hotel room? I would check to see if that's Winston. <laughs> I haven't seen him for a while now. If you've seen Winston, please do let me know. I thought he was in the freezer. Oh, I said he was on an ice, darling. Uh, oh, he's on a bender. <laughs> oh, not that kind <laughs> oh. of ice you have. What a flea. <laughs> hey, that's mine as well. Um... All right, we've got one here from Dirty Man Whore. Has Auntie Loosh ever had sex in public? Well, I think I'll wait for Winston to return before <laughs> I answer that question. Okay, no worries. Has Auntie Loosh had sex in public? Yeah, no. no. Okay. No. Auntie Loosh is... Nothing in the 1930s before the war? You weren't well, gallivanting before, around? Before or... the war, it wasn't really about sexual intercourse or coitus, as they called it back mm, then. Mm. It was more about the good, wholesome family fun. Okay. Right. Like roasting dead men. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is the last question of the day, Arnie uh -oh. Loosh. Now, I know you like to finish on a lighter note. So we thought we'd ask you a much more softer question to end the night. I do like them hard, now, too. Now, this is from Kind and Horny. And Auntie Loosh, mm -hmm. Kind and Horny wants to know, what is Auntie Loosh's purpose in life? <sighs> well, that depends. Please. That depends. Um... Auntie Lucia's purpose in life, obviously, is to entertain, is to provide a little bit of love, a little bit of laughter. But ultimately, at the end of the day, I think... What? I'm trying to have a serious moment here, and you're just so laughing at my blanket. They're laughing at my blanket, ladies and gentlemen. It's just a blanket. My legs are cold. I'm an old woman. Keep going, Auntie Loosh. 
So I think I think Auntie Lucia's purpose in life is is obviously a little bit of fun, a little bit of fun, you know. Like if you can't laugh at yourself, how the hell are you going to laugh at other people? Can you get an amen? Hello, Mr. RuPaul, lady. Mm-hmm. But I think in general our purpose in life um, – I want to leave something behind that makes people smile. Oh, that's nice. I want to leave something behind that when I'm gone, my memory will still live on in people's minds and people's hearts. And one of the one of the um, one of my favorite quotes in a line was that uh, one of my favorite lines in a song is um, they say that you die twice: once when you die, and once when they say you're name for the last time and i would really like it if my name was said for the last time well after i've died wow so i'm going to give that to you guys because for me as a person um it's not just about living my life and making as much money as i can it's about leaving something behind it's about a legacy Mm. it's about creating something that brings joy and happiness to people and leaving a lasting positive memory on their Impression on their life. So, yeah, that's it. That, we'll that would be that. it. Just one more, Aunty Loosh. What's, what's your message for... You'd like to know my quote of the week? What's your quote of the week? Don't yuck somebody else's yum. Hmm, I like that. Just because somebody else likes something and you might not, doesn't necessarily mean that you have to make them feel like crap because they like what they like. Yeah, I like that. Well, that's a good way to end today's show. But Aunty Loosh... <laughs> loves you all though darling yes. even those dirty dirty girls who keep on writing into me asking whether or not auntie Luce will do this episode topless i can promise you there's no nipples under there <laughs> <laughs> oh all right well um, all right, well auntie Luce needs to go have a smoke now so um <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna end this episode right here thanks um, auntie Luce. thanks for having thanks for coming in mate any time. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> sure Loosh will allow me to steal yeah. this. This feels like it was a <laughs> episode. <laughs> but you know what? We'll put it out anyway. If you don't like it, stick it up your bum. <laughs> <laughs> I've been Arnie Loosh. That's been Lockie. <laughs> Say hi to your mum for me. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.